Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And in this video, I have a Verizon network update for you guys. So the site that I had shown you guys a few days ago is now all but completed. I know you still see the wire hanging from it, but they have they have all three sectors now ripped, replaced, and they added the C-band equipment. So what you see here to the front sector and the sector to the right that's the 8863 radio that I've been discussing in, in several videos now. And then off to the left, the sector that's, that's to the left, you do see a 6449. Now, this is about the third site in my area that I've seen set up like this. So I have to start questioning that this is by design. This is not just them doing that randomly. They're doing this by design where they're adding the 8863 on certain sectors facing a certain way. And then they add the 6449 to, you know, in a different direction. Now, this could still be largely due to the shortage. So they are placing the 6449 on the busiest sector. So that could still be the case. But I am starting to question if this isn't by design. Because there are some sites now that have been upgraded where they just added the 8863 on all three sectors that did not get any 6449. But in this case, in two other sites, they did manage to add at least one 6449 air from Ericsson. So that's just something that I wanted to bring up in this video that I'm noticing. I will keep you guys in the loop and I will start asking uh, asking some questions as to why this may be happening. I still think I'm about 99% sure it's due to the shortage that they can't get enough of the 6449s in to do a full-scale deployment on all three sectors. But it is very interesting to see. Also, one thing that I, that I do want to point out just briefly before I end this video, I have not yet spotted the Radio 4408. That is the CBRS radio. I have yet to spot this on the site. So I will be going back to the site in, in a few days once the once it's fully completed, right? Once the cabling is removed and then everything else is locked up. And then I'll do another, uh, another site inspection to see if they do add the CBRS radio. But for now, it does look like it is it has not made it onto the site yet. So make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel. Make sure you like, share, subscribe for more. Follow my social media outlets. This is Tyrone with Tech Life. See y'all in the next one. Peace.